Hi and Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome back once again to my channel, Technology Information. Today we are going to talk about the ignition or starting circuit of every engine in the world. Before the starting the video, if you are first time on this channel, please make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification for more latest updates videos. Thank you. First of all, diesel or gasoline. These two types of engine starting circuit, ignition circuit. Today I, I will explain you in the better way to understand you are 95% of every engine how the starting circuit is working. Okay. First of all, we have different kinds of starting circuits. For example, push button or or key switch or touch panel but the working principle is same of each of every one engine the starting circuit is same but some vehicles cars generators Starting from push buttons, some from key switch, ignition key, like a car, old model cars, some from starting from panels, like a new model car, Tesla car or other some cars. But actually what, actually the real circuits are working. I am talking about that. This is our starter motor this is all starter solenoid S terminal B pass tube B negative This is of our key switch. This is our push button. This is our touch pad. When we want to start the engine, how the engine is start? Okay. Every engine have separate relays for starting for accessory turning on and off and so on first of all our engine is need to be on fuel first then ignition system turning on and after that cranking the engine to start what is the actually function this is our four point Four pins relays. This have four four pins. These two pins of each relay is relay supply. Okay, that means this relay need a power ground and phase uh, and pass voltage okay when we trying to start the engine what will happen a cover this is our fuel relay this is our starter motor relay okay when we sing when we 
This is our three points. We passed your accessory and start. Okay. When we crank the engine, the engine send command to this relay through the wire. This relay one side already grounded to the chest. And we take some load from the fuse box. Sixty M fuse. The battery manual is coming in and coming out to this point. The relay at this point. And from here out to this point to the starter motor. Okay. This is our fuel solenoid. One side is ground, then one needs. This is our accessory. Our accessory wire is coming from here to here. And we move ignition position, ignition switch to the on position, turning on position. After that, First, activate our fuels. Then, when we turn the ignition switch to, to the turning uh, to the start position, the engine cranking. When the engine cranking, the engine will start. This is the starting circuit of every engine, any single engine, diesel or gasoline. Let's explain me with the diagram. This is our fuse box. This is our main car battery. The battery one side is grounded to the chest. Okay, once wire is going to here, there is a fuse. 10M, 30M, 50M, 60M, 80M for different appliances. Here is fuse in, here is fuse out. Fuse in, fuse out. All fuses is in from here with the battery main pass to cable and all out from here. For example, this 80M for starting because the cranking starter motor take a heavy load after that the 60 amps that means the fuel shut off solenoid okay 60 amps after that the 30 amps fan radiator cooling fan okay that's the real actual diagram of fuse box this is our car battery this is grown into the whole chassis this is the positive one this is our fuse box this have different fuses and different relays from different application okay for example we take one example from here only of starting this is our starting fuse 80 amps this all fuses directly attached attached with the battery cable this is the inside of all fuses and outside of from here this one is out from here to the relay load side this is our relay for example, our relay have four pins. These two is these two is for relay coil, and this two for load and 
and this one is for load out okay here yeah, is what's happened when we try to to start the engine this is getting output to the relay load side this is our ignition key switch okay this is 1.2 and 3 accessory accessory means radio fuel system or etc and this is all starting that's mean when we turn on the ignition key switch to the on position on position after get try to cranking this give one output from here to relay the relay coil side this side positive after that the, this side is already jumped with the ground when the relay is activated the relay close these two points these two points when the relay close these two points load in and this is the load out this is our this is our starter motor this is the s terminal this coming to this after that our engine is cranking moon i hope you understand fully with the great example of and great uh, lectures uh, thanks for watching see you next time goodbye